Hey guys, it's your girl Secret Tia. We're gonna drive and chat. So listen, this is a quick like little dating up update, okay? I'll make it quick because I'm about to go to the nail salon. I need a pedicure because these are press-ons. We don't need to get them done. Yes, I did the most, but it's okay. Anyway, so I started my dating profile. I actually started like matching with people. I actually started chatting with people. But I'm struggling because you gotta talk to people every day. Like, it's hard, it's hard. It's hard to go from doing what I want to trying to be intentional and communicating and getting to know people and then being mindful of having to like reply to text every single day. Now, I gave these people my iPhone number my, i get three people my phone number so far because now that it's not like my main phone number i'm just giving that shit out they're like have a number yeah because you can have my iphone number they don't know i mean don't ask don't tell but i don't say hey this is my second phone because that's a little suspect but i give them my iphone number and then i haven't seen my iphone <laughs> what's today monday i haven't seen my iphone since saturday so, I haven't spoken to these people in days. And I saw messages and I'm like, I low-key feel bad, but then I don't because I have to be true to myself. But that's my struggle, y'all. I'm struggling with talking to people every day. I know it sounds weird and it might be a little bit weird, but I really feel like I really have to adjust because if I'm really, like, for real, legitimately trying to meet somebody, then I really have to be okay with talking to people. And I'm not really. So, I'm just like, you know, I don't know if I want to be bothered. You're going to park in the back or the front? You're going to park in the back. Okay. So, I feel like I legitimately need to, um, you know, talk to people. Sorry, I got distracted by this person parking so that's all y'all i don't want to make this mad long-winded i'm about to go get my feet done i might have to cut my little press-ons i just did the most on because i'm gonna do my hair start my hair at least i'm gonna see because i gotta go into the office i drink some coffee so i might actually be able to finish it depending on what i do to it I haven't decided yet but it is what it is so anyway y'all let me know how y'all deal with that like people who date um and don't be like, well, I've been married 15 years, so I'm not talking to you because you can't help me, okay? I'm talking about people who've been single for a while. And I know three years is not that long, but it's kind of long. Help. And also, why does everybody have this huge beard? Why? Why? Like, if, if like, 100 people like me, like, 80 of y'all got this huge thing going on. Y'all all don't have to do that. That does not automatically make you attractive. I don't know who sent this memo out that said, grow your beard out to be attractive. It ain't true. It's not. Y'all all don't have to do that, okay? So I'm just saying, some, some of y'all could lose it. All right, bye.